Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, we're at Laoye Lamki, and uh, oh, it's close to the house. Um, yeah, we're gonna eat some. We're gonna eat some uh, goat hot pot and uh, grilled food today. So let's see how everything tastes. All right, so this apparently this restaurant got a lot of good reviews. Um, like you're looking at like four four out of five stars and like over like a thousand reviews. So we're gonna <coughs> try it out. It smells good. It's packed and um, yeah. So first off, we got some uh, <coughs> we got some goat meat and I think we got the breast part of the the goat as well too. All right, you know, you know. Yeah. And uh, we have what is this? It's like a bean paste that you dip it into. Bean curd. Bean curd, not really my favorite, but um, you know it's uh, it's what you dip with in the in the meal. So hey, went in Rome, right? Okay, so I think this restaurant um, only has two types of two types of food or two types of uh, way they prepare it, which is the, the grill and then also the, the hot pot. So we opted to go for the grilled meat first. After we're done with this, we're gonna go for the for the hot pot afterwards. Yeah, this is this is the new. Yeah. Alright guys, let's try the first bite. I think this is the goat breast. It's grilled. Um, there's like a sesame seasoning on it. Let's try it out. That's not you, baby. Yeah, cut out Okra. Dip it in a little bean curd. Mm. Delicious. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I think this is the pig breast. So we're gonna try this again. Uh, oh, sorry, no, sorry, my mistake. This is the gold breast. So we're gonna try it, see how it tastes by itself before dipping it in the bean curd. Fantastic. Seasoning, just a slightly salty, little, little sweet, caramelized. Um, there's sesame seeds on top. 
you really have to dip it into the sauce, the bean curd, bring up the full flavor. The goat breast, it's um, uh, it's a little bit, um, it's a little bit more, I say like, um, like, like chewy, but it's fatty. You know, you, you, you can kind of taste like like a fatty texture to it. So that's that's the difference between the the goat breast and the, the meat, of just like just the meat of the goat by itself. Yeah, so this is the meat, goat meat. So we're just gonna try it, dip it in the sauce, the bean curd, and the saute. So it's gonna be a little bit spicy. Some pickled cabbage too. You can chase it with the vegetables. Yeah. Fantastic. Good flavor. Eat. get the goat breast um, when, you, when you come here and you try the food you won't be disappointed I've come to realize that a lot of things that I didn't eat back home I'm starting to really like now that I'm in uh, Vietnam for example the bean curd is one and okra, and, uh, okra is another was it was never really a big fan of okra with the way it's like over here or you know like if, if you grill it properly it like it tastes really good oh so, yeah get there. Okay, course two. This is the hot pot. This is marrow from a cow, beef marrow, and they give you extra soup. Put inside vegetables, noodles, tofu, egg noodle, and more noodle, and fried tofu. Yes, it's his uh, uh, marrow, marrow, marrow. This the uh, marrow. Cái mà ở trong cái xương không nó đập 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 xuống nó ra nó trong rồi. Let's try the broth by itself. is like I don't know how to describe it but like it's kind of like like herby like medicinal kind of broth um, like 
I, I don't know. It's, it tastes good. I just don't know how to describe the flavor. Okay, last piece. On to the next meal. completely wrong. This is a uh, goat meatball. <laughs> it's not pork or fish or any type of seafood. It's goat. chewy but <clears throat> that's normal um, but yeah the meat's really tender all right we got the marrow Let's try it by itself It's interesting. It's like a little chewy on the inside, but like on the outside around it, it's very soft. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. It's actually really fatty too. Mm. Okay, 
Let's try one more with the with the sauce. Let's see if I let's see if I change my mind. Dip it in the sauce. Great. All right. I'm gonna drop the egg noodle in. Going in. Mm. Make dinner. Huh? Make dinner. Dinner. Oh, good, good. Good. Like good. Did you try? Thanks, so. You don't like it? Yeah, I'll take it. Alright, it's time for the noodles. Okay. Mom is really good. I think they deep fry it first and then they put it inside the inside the soup and let it simmer and soak up all the broth. All the flavor goes in here. Oh my god. To die for. Eat it with the egg noodles. It soaks up all the flavor. It's so good. Mm. Yeah. Taro. Mm. Can't forget the goat meat. The flavor from the bean curd just makes everything like taste so much better. I mean, like it's already good. Like the broth itself is really good. Like the meat's really tender. Um, but like when you dip it in the bean curd, it just makes it like so like, addicting, man. <laughs> No. <laughs> we were so busy eating all the meat and all the noodles. We got to put the vegetables in. <laughs> I'm gonna finish up the rest of the meal and um, we'll see you afterwards and um, get our final thoughts on everything. Alright? Hi guys, we're back. <clears throat> finished everything, well, most of everything, and I am completely full. I'm gonna go for one last piece of the meat. Tender to the very last piece. Perfect.
Sweat from the hot pot from the weather. Okay. okay, final cost for the whole meal six hundred and fourteen thousand, which is I think about a little bit less than 30 bucks um, but we got the small portion and like for, for two I'm like super full like I could barely walk um, <coughs> everything was good the broth was delicious um, taro perfect um, goat meatball first time trying it I like it I dig it and the marrow was kind of like it's like a hit or miss um, it was like a little bit chewy on the inside, so I wasn't really used to the flavor, but it wasn't bad. It was it was different, you know, just gotta get used to it. Um, the goat, nice and tender, perfect. Of course, the skin is gonna be a little bit chewy, but that's normal. I've had a lot of uh, goat hot pot in the past, and so far, this one takes the cake. You know, it's one of the better spots. Guys, check it out. If you're ever in, uh, in this area, I'll put the the name of the restaurant information below uh, once again restaurant name is Laoye Lamki so goat hot pot Lamki and it looks like they have two locations one here in Tanban and the other in uh, Dalak so I think this might, it might be a franchise I don't know but whatever just come by eat have a good time um, if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like and subscribe we'll see you on the next one mahalo everybody take care peace